Hi, I'm John Jensen with Georgia DNR Wildlife Conservation Section and we're here today at the Amphibian Foundation in Atlanta to talk about Argentine black and white tegus. Argentine black and white tegus are a large lizard not native to the United States. It has become established as an exotic invasive species in several sites in South Florida and we now believe in the Tombs and Tattnall County area of Georgia. We're trying to remove them from the wild because they can have negative impacts on our native species. Um, they eat just about anything they want, plant and animal matter, and one of their favorite foods are eggs from ground nesting animals such as gopher tortoises, our protected state reptile, uh, birds including turkeys and quail. They're also a burrowing species. They'll make their own burrows but they'll also use the burrows made by other animals, including our native gopher tortoise, and they may displace gopher tortoises in doing so. So we really encourage the general public to report sightings of this animal. That allows us to uh, determine where to focus our trapping efforts in an effort to eradicate this species. Additionally, if you're able to safely and humanely dispatch of the animal, we encourage that and we want that information too. Argentine black and white tegus are in general kind of black and white and banded. They can get up to four and a half feet long. Many of the public that encounter these often report them thinking that they look like a baby alligator well away from the water. These are very common in the pet trade, but we ask folks that keep these as pets to be responsible and if you've come to a point where you no longer want this animal there are reptile adoption groups that uh, may take it and try to find a home releasing it into the wild is the absolute worst thing to do it will affect our native species and we can't have that